how do you know if you love someone? How do you really, really know if you love someone? You ready for this? I'm going to tell you now. All right? A guy is going out with a girl, and all of a sudden, they're eating in a restaurant, let's say, and the tuna, somebody next to him ordered tuna. So she says, I hate tuna. I hate, I hate, I hate tuna. And meanwhile, the guy himself, he sees the tuna passing by, and she keeps on saying, I hate tuna. By the way, anybody who eats tuna, I could smell his breath, and it stinks, and it's the worst, and I hate tuna. So the guy's going out with this girl. So if he really likes her, how would he react? Yeah, I hate tuna too. I'm never eating tuna again in my life. But tuna is the worst. Tuna is this, tuna is that. Says, when you love someone, you hate what they hate. You get what I just said or no? Yeah? The Hazon Ish used to say, how do you know how much you love Hashem? How do you know what's your barometer of love of Hashem? When you go against what Hashem hates. That's how you know the love that you have for Hashem is so great. That's the barometer. From 1 to 100, the, what, what, when you know this is what God hates, you hate it to the most degree, that you know you are in love with Hashem to no end. So now we have to see what Hashem hates. Rabbi Yishe, what does Hashem hate? It says, Hashem... Sone Zima. Hashem hates. What does that mean, Zima? Immorality. God hates immorality. So therefore, He hates it with a passion. Therefore, when you have that Hasmi Shalom, immorality, you heard him. What? You want to throw up? It's disgusting. You go with someone, you, there's a girl in the street that's not sni'ut. She's immodest. That is zima. That's called what? Immorality. That a person has to cringe in his bones and say, oh, I can't look, it's disgusting. That is a barometer to show how much love you have for God. You hear that? You hear what's going on? I'm telling you, Yesod. Yesodot of Yesodot. Hashem hates it so much that everybody knows a girl getting married. They know what, 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 what they're getting married for. You know, they're getting married to have children. They're doing... So if a person says it with his mouth, it says, it. oh yeah, you know, you know what they're doing tonight? You say it with your mouth, it's brought down, Chazal say, 70 years of good to, could turn out to be bad. I'll read it to you. You ready? You ready? Everybody's ready? It says in Masechet Shabbat, Daflam Gimel Amur Aleph. It says over there, Hakol Yodim Kala Lama Nechnes Lahopa. Everybody knows what this girl is going. She's going to Hopa. They know what they're doing that night. El Hakol Amen Abel Pivo Amrof. Anybody says, Oh, you know what this is doing tonight? Afilu Gzar Din Shel Shavim Shana Letova. Even if they'll have. Gzar Din, he has 70 years of good. The guy, 70 years, he's going to be healthy, he's going to be able to see, he's going to be able to do this. Hofchim lo They'll change it into the bed. Why are you changing it to bed? Because you say what they're going to do in tonight? Are you crazy? Are you out of your mind? Why? It's part of zima. It's part of immorality. And that's why the barometer to know if you love God or not, of course, everybody loves Hashem. But the more despicable that is to your eyes, that's how much love you have for God Himself. Hashem Sone Zima. He hates immorality. And therefore, a person, you have to understand, your brother is, oh, this or that. When it comes to immorality, oh, disgusting. I know, fact. My friend, was dating a girl. They were about to get engaged. She canceled. The, before they got engaged, she dumped the guy. So now he got involved. Now, well, why are you dumping him? What did he do wrong? Well, what happened exactly? Well, what's, what's the dumping all about? You know what she said? 
She said, I went on a date with him. I loved this guy. This guy was amazing. This guy was great. He had all, he was good looking, he had money, he had good character, he had everything that a girl would want. So what are you dumping him for? Throwing him in the trash can after, after almost getting engaged? Before you got engaged, you dump him? What happened? No, I don't want to get engaged to such a guy. So what did he do wrong? You know what she told me? She said, when I was on a date, he told me, oh, that's your friend? Oh, I know your friend. I saw her at 7-Eleven. She's such a good girl. And she's like, you're talking about my friend? You're looking at the girl and you're saying she's a good girl. She's like this. She's like that. You're talking, whatever it may be, I'm sure. It was, he wasn't the biggest tzaddik about the, uh, her friend, you know. But she told me. She said the fact that a guy could speak about another lady, I don't care, she's my best friend. You speak about another lady, oh yeah, she's a good looking girl, she's this, she's that. Are you crazy? I want out. Because this is the border of immorality. Hashem sonezima. Hashem hates immorality. A guy is looking at another girl. That is is called zima, it's called immorality. You'll be disgusted in a situation. Like, I'm gonna throw up, I'm gonna vomit. What are you vomiting? It's, not, it's natural, it's this, it's that. What natural? If you love God, that means I love him so much, I love what he loves and I hate what he hates. What does he hate? He hates immorality, I also hate immorality, I can't. I vomit. I can't look at a girl that's not. I can't. I can't do it. I can't look at another lady that's not my my wife. I can't do it. It's it's not me. Why? Because he my God hates it. I hate it. It says a la- a person looking at a pinky of a lady for pleasure. A person looking at a pinky. I'm not looking for pleasure. Look, looking for pleasure. It's the same thing as looking at heaven forbid at at, at, at a lady that a covered part of a lady. You know that. Gemara says that. Same thing. One same thing. You know why? Because again, it's coming from the same shortish. It's coming from the sta- same uh, root. And what is that? It's called zima. I love God so much. I vomit what he vomits. He vomits immorality. I vomit immorality. See a girl and say, you don't look. You look. To, I, say, I can't. I was with one of my good chavutot. One of my good chavutot. I'm telling you, when I would walk in the streets with him, if you would see an immodest lady, he would turn around. He would turn around. He couldn't, he couldn't handle it. Why? Because he knows. He knows. God hates immorality. God hates the fact that you're not allowed to look at something that you're not supposed to look at. Asud. Therefore, he hates it. I also hate it. I vomit when I see it. So, Bezad Hashem, we zuchet to this lesson to love God as much as we can.